Spring is coming, and so is your chance to sign up for a community garden plot. Priscilla explains how the community garden grew into what it is today. I have a Boy Scout who wants to do this, and I have a tractor, and then I had a volunteer group who said, I have 20 people, can, can you use them one day somewhere along the line? So all of a sudden these three things converged and I said, I think we have a place in the commission, Conservation Commission had some conservation land that they had, that had been a farm, so that we wanted to create a community garden there. So uh, March 12th, which is a Thursday evening, we'll meet at City Hall on the third floor and uh, anybody who's interested in the garden can sign up. What we do is the returning gardeners get first choice and then, then we open it up to a lottery for everybody who's either called in or, or is there. If you can't make it to the meeting on Thursday, but you're still interested in a plot, here is what you should do. So they can call us here at, um, at the conservation office um, and just leave their number, tell us that they, they want to be in the lottery, but be specific about that so, and then we'll put their name in and, and then we'll call them after the meeting. Even with all of this snow, Priscilla has high hopes for planting some seeds in April. We have master gardeners who've been gardening forever and we have brand new people who say, so what do I do first? So, um, so the combination is great because the, uh, the people who are part of the garden, of the community garden, tend to share information with people who are there. If you have never gardened before, a community garden plot could be just what you are looking for. We usually target April 15th as the day that the soil is dry enough to be able to, to work. The, the, the rule of thumb is if you can pick it up and it becomes a, a mashed potato, then that's, it's too, still too wet and you don't want to uh, work wet soil at all. It just it compacts it and it makes it not good for your plants. And when the soil is dry enough, it, and that's the key. For Marlboro This Week, I'm Vanessa Rose.